How do you support people who are on their journey to a higher dimension, a higher vibration? Well, it's often difficult. Why is it often difficult? Um, because a lot of people change their mind. In other words, they um, act out and um, put something out that uh, doesn't vibrate at uh, who they say they are. What do I mean by that? Well, someone who is um, working on themselves, letting go of ego, and then, um, you know, they do something, say something, post something that is not in line with what they say they are. So, are you going to support them by saying, um, whatever you just posted there, um, it's not really high vibration, and, you know, I've got issues with it. I mean, do you want me to say something if to support you, to help you see? Or do you basically want to go? I mean, are you going to shoot me, the messenger, someone who's been working for a very long time on letting go of ego and letting go of low vibrational items? If you're going to go like this to me, how long do you think I'm going to stick around? Not very long. How many chances do you get? Um, three strikes, you're out. Yeah, seriously. Um, I'm not here to support you and do your homework, to do your work. What does it mean? It means I've spent a lot of time on myself, reading, 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 and looking at it and looking to see uh, what's the world like. Does it match? No, it doesn't. What am I like? Do I match what I'm reading? Um, more and more all the time. How long has my journey been? Uh, let's say um, longer than I care to imagine. It's uh, been a long time. So, uh, I, I don't really want to do other people's homework. How much do I want to do their homework? Um, if they're putting in the effort, um, I'm going to see it. I'm going to see it, and I'm going to go, you're doing good work. And if you fall down and you need some help, well, I know you've been working hard at it, and I'll be available. But... If you're not doing any work at all, you know, it's like uh, I've talked to you several times and I've brought up stuff about earth ascension, about the scale of human consciousness, raising your vibration, letting go of ego. And if I've, you know, talked to you about these things and it falls on dead ears, you're a lost cause to me. You know, I'll find somebody else who's more interested in what I'm talking about. How many other people are out there that are going to support you? I don't know. How many times have you heard these words, ego? How much, how, you know, did you go to the library? Did you go on the internet to look things up? Or, you know, did you talk to someone like me and then go right back to your old ways the next day? I see both kinds. But if you want other people to support you, uh, you got to show them that that's what you're really all about. They're just going to say, that person's not ripe. You're just not a ripe banana. You're not ready. And there's lots of people that are just not ready, not ready. So what does it mean? Well, it means uh, a great separation 
those people who uh, want to do nothing and, you know, vibrate low, and those people that uh, don't want that anymore, they're sick of it. A great separation of the humans. What's going to happen with the separation? I don't know. But that's what's going on. Are there some people that are just slow? No. There are some people that just have huge egos and they like it that way. So the people who are letting go of the ego, what's going to happen to them? It's going to be not ego driven. But I can't see people who are letting go of ego wanting to hang around people who are very ego. Is it their job to be bodhisattvas and sit around waiting for perfect enlightenment for all these other people? It could be. I guess it's my ego. If I'm going to stay in a physical form, what do I want to do in my physical form? I want to have fun. I don't want to be um, chained to a desk doing some stupid Joe job. Like, you know, a lot of the Joe jobs that I've done, I don't want to do them anymore. And I'm not going to pay uh, outrageous prices to egoic people who um, think that they own the world. I guess I'm out on a limb. I'm just going to keep raising my vibration, raising my, vi my vibration, raising my vibration, and see what happens. Insecure. What does that mean? It means feeling like um, I have no guarantees that things are going to be better if I try to let go of my ego. You just need to do more homework. You need to have more stories about people who are high vibration. What they're like. You just don't have enough in your personal database of these kind of people. So, it's time for you to do homework. You have to do a lot of reading, a lot of listening to videos, and then you have to go and sift through it all to see, you know, does this sound right? It's your job, it's your mission, that's why you're here on planet Earth today. You are not on planet Earth here today to uh, be chained to someone's desk and be their slave. That's the first hint. If you're doing slave labor, that's not your purpose. Your purpose is to escape from uh, slave owners. Is it easy? If you uh, raise your vibration, meditate every day, read books about people who have done it, you will find a path. I'm coming up on 10 minutes. What else can I tell you? Uh, someone keeps wanting to say, is it easy? Nothing on earth is easy.